Yes, we do give thanks for life and a mighty life, even and we do give thanks definitely as we go in through the whole realms of the food of seven, as we, you know, give thanks definitely as we are here with you live again in the season of of all festivities. You know, you know right now we are in the season of festivity. The season of, you know, um, where everyone is, is, is having a good time. Everyone is happy and having a great time. We give thanks definitely as we are in this wonderful moment, you know, a moment whereby as a people we are we are working towards our own upliftment and also the upliftment of other people because it is important that within uh, even within our own upliftment that we you know that we learn how to uplift other people because at the end of the day you know self love is basically the love that we have as a people to specifically allow to overflow and allow people to glorify and be part of whatever it is that we are doing so i give thanks for this divine opportunity as definitely once more food of seven and we give thanks for a sacred and divine moment as as we give thanks for all those people who who full take in the whole um journey beyond wellness rejuvenation session where we had in saint lucia just completed and all those people who actually stayed forward um a bit more even when it comes to the whole aspect of wanting to stay in St. Lucia more because they actually really full joy the whole journey beyond wellness. And I give thanks even for, you know, all those people specifically who were there with us and those people who even locally from St. Lucia who came during particular sessions where we had the, 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 the summer solstice celebration. I mean, I give thanks for all those people who came during that celebration time also to sit down with us and to, you know, um, have a wonderful positive affirmation and meditation time. So we do glorify, you know, and I give thanks for life and a mighty life given. And we, we glorify that even in this time when, when people's focus and the, and the whole energy is on um, revelry and dr drunkenness and and eating and dancing, all type of things, you know, we give thanks that at least we stay focused because, you know, it's kind of evil season, you know, and that's the time whereby a lot of finances are invested in, in costumes and rum and, and bacchanal and all these type of things. And yet still, as a people, you know, people complain that your yeah, things are hard and the country don't have money and Yet still we get enough money to to go into carnival and, and drink rum and, and dance and, and prance and all of these different type of things there. So it's a time of self reflection. Every other people we need to reflect ourselves reflect within our own self, our true self, our fundamental understanding of exactly what is it that we are going to be contributing to, to creation and how is it that we are going to assist the creator in creating that divine and sacred place, that place whereby, you know, one could be in an atmosphere and in a zone whereby they, they sincerely and they not just live for the moment, but they, they have that culture of actually living in a peaceful and happy manner. It's very important to be happy. I am happy, happy, happy. In happy in Farai. You know, it's very important to be happy. You know, you have to be happy. Happiness is the foundation to, of wellness. You know, I mean, there is no way that you could heal yourself from any kind of disease or sickness if it is that you're not happy. Happiness is the foundation. Happiness is the key. You have to be happy. You must be happy, you know, to be able to heal yourself from any type of condition. So a man must, must be willing to and must fully embrace whatever makes him happy. You know, sometimes the way that we have been actually brought up as a people mom is stronger 80 and blessed love my lord love love give thanks woman and woman peace good evening blessed Dolores alexander honorable blessed love bobo give thanks bless celestine blessed love give thanks definitely for all those of you who have actually joined us this evening and all those of you that are to join us both on our youtube channel and on facebook 
on Calabash Television and also live on TV right here in St. Lucia. So we give thanks for all of us that are together in this divine moment and this divine space. Rastafari. So it is important that, yes, Ronald Williams, blessed love, give thanks, honorable. Yes, give thanks, my Lord, glorify, black heart of love. It is important that we share this divine space as a people, a space where we, are, we deliberately and consciously push out the energy for the betterment of the world and the betterment of creation. Because if it is that more people would actually come together in a sacred space, in a divine space, and they like consciously, they consciously, deliberately, right, they deliberately, consciously, deliberately, consciously, deliberately, consciously, right, work towards, you know, pushing out energies to the universe, out into the world, that basically um, is for the benefit and for the upliftment of nature and the upliftment of creation. You're talking about, okay, yes, man, you know, helping the rivers to actually flow better, desilting the rivers or taking out rotten wood from the rivers or cleaning the beaches or planting some trees or, you understand, simple things, you know, um, stopping the use of gramoxone and pesticides and weedy sites and, you know, have an organic farm or whatever it is that, that an individual person does. When it comes to the whole aspect of some positive works, because you could have the speaking of it. You could speak about it. You could say whatever you want to say about it. You could mention it to all type of people. You could actually talk, 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 talk. But with all the speaking that you're speaking, there must be some deliberate and some conscious action. You're supposed to act. You have to act. You know, so we cannot afford to be the whole spiritist people that, that kind of... <gasps> Abracadabra people and, and people who, you know, kazam and it just happens and it falls from the sky and they're waiting for God to come down from heaven and do everything for them. I'm talking about as a people, as a conscious people, as a society of people, whereby the things that we say, everything that we say, we consciously work towards bringing it into creation. You know, that meaning that, that as a people, when you speak something, you don't just speak it, you... You work towards fulfilling it. Yes, but Francis, blessed love, honorable. The medication work wonders for the men at the grocery station. Thanks, but blessed night. Hope you visit us again. Oh, give thanks, honorable. Um, but I mean, definitely, you know, well, um, brother Bert is linking from the grocery police station. Definitely, you know, we went to school together, you know, and oh, good win, Richardson. Oh, honorable, give thanks. I just passed by you all there. You know, by, and by the show, say there, you know, I see you outside there, but I was going to my program, so I had some goodies for you. Definitely, I'll have to link up the eye. Honorable. Yes, you want to say? Yes, give thanks. Love, thanks for this energy, or oh, give thanks. Love, energy, all the time. So when it is that we now, as a people, we consciously able to sit down and meditate and think about the betterment of life, whatever it is that you're doing, whatever, whatever your work, whatever... You know, um, your religious beliefs, what your spiritual beliefs, how you live your life, it's not important. You know, what you must understand is that is our uniqueness, our, our differences is what make us strong. You know, it is, not, it, is, it is not that all of us are the same and we have to be praising the same thing and everybody have to be Rastafari like Chris Kailash. No, man. I mean, you could be a Christian and be a real good Christian or Adventist and keep your Sabbath day holy good and keep the Sabbath holy good and, and do your thing and follow the... The, the health message by, by your prophetess LNG, right? I mean, that's good, perfect. I mean, if because religion really is supposed to be that ritualistic practice, that, 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 that what you do over and 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 over again, right? This, that ritualistic practice that you do over and over again that could help you to bring you to that perfection of spirituality, whereby you become all embracing, all encompassing, non judging, and, and forgiving and a humble spirit and they say well you are a spiritual being give thanks i mean um, nicole carson good evening blessed love from connecticut usa oh heart of love honorable killer pierre from trinidad i mean definitely give thanks blessed love honorable watching from trinidad give thanks honorable how all heart of love connecticut trinidad give thanks for all those people who actually looking and, and checking out the vibes and understanding exactly what is happening when it comes to the whole aspect of our intentions, our intentions to actually create a good and a great space. 
no matter where you are. No matter where you are, yes, Maria Henriquez, Henriquez, Florida. I give thanks. Give thanks for our people from Florida giving us that blessings and that big up there. And as we would just focus on, you know, all, all of us who are in this space, even watching the program and on YouTube, on Facebook, on Calabash TV in St. Lucia live, you know, at least if we zoom in our energies and we deliberately focus on, you know, a better, okay, a better world. You know, if you're in Florida, a healthier Florida, whereby, you know, you send out love and, you know, you send out that energy of, of understanding and peace and, 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 and calmness, you know, and tolerance, you know, and justice and equity, you know, just send that energy that people could actually, you know, zone into it. So if two people in Florida is doing it, yes, Kevin Paul, blessed love, honorable, watching from St. Lucia. Oh, of course, beloved, give thanks for the Paul family. Give thanks for the great father himself, Kevin Paul, man. Give thanks. From LA. Oh, okay, all right. So toxic, but here now. Oh, my goodness. I mean, even if LA is toxic, the fact that, you know, you are there, right? You make it better. You make LA better. So just send out some, some um, charcoal. <laughs> the, the um, I, I do call it again, activated charcoal energy, you know, and some, how do they call this thing there again? Um, busy energy, you know, and some cassia latter energy and some palm oil energy to weed out the toxins from LA, you know? So give thanks. I mean, no matter where you are, as toxic as it is, remember, you know, water storm memories. And the same way that, that LA, if LA have water and, and Florida has water and, and it's the same ocean that we are all, you know, the ocean, you know, it's one ocean, you know, one, one big body of water. So when you utter something in St. Lucia in the water, that big body of water, that water could actually store memories. Water is a wonderful thing. Water is powerful, you know, so how we deal with water as if water is just something ordinary but i mean the fact that you are by a body of water right or whatever water living what i'm talking about living water not, not dead water you know there is dead water <laughs> when you have water from a bottle that water is dead you know you have to really bless that water to make it life water <laughs> you know so if you have a body of water like an ocean a stream a flowing water and you utter a word oh give thanks for life for the mighty life giver love 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 all healing and peace and eradicating all disease and you know all you know and you send that through the water as the water runs away and the water moves through right as that water moves through the water actually traps that energy and catches that energy the words the molecules of the of the water actually change the crystalline structure of the water actually change the water becomes very the crystals become very homogeneous you know hexagonal beautiful you know like gems like precious right definitely and that message is transferred and the person down the river when they drink of that water definitely they get healed i mean just because you are uttering such positive energy you know the person who goes into that water into the sea and you over that ocean and you're sending that love energy that peace and that healing energy and that you know equity and tolerance and humility and all that energy somebody go in the water and they feel the vibes because the water actually carry the energy so does the atmosphere the air because the air itself contains water molecules. That's why in the, in, the, in the heavens, you know, it's clouds, you know. Angelina, okay, give thanks, Angelina. Powerful, bravo. Give thanks. Um, Rastafari, give thanks, give thanks. Human and human, truth, 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 truth. Yeah, man, definitely. So the water, because, because you must understand that even your physical structure is about a 75 to 80% water. And then, I mean, flowing water, because that's why, and then your arteries and your veins don't have no right-hand turns, like a, like a turn, like this, like a, a 90 degree turn. No, I mean, that's not 90 degree, almost 90 degree. Can I do a 90? Okay, probably that. Okay, that, that, that's like a 90 degree angle. Okay, all right, you know what I'm saying? 90 degree angle, all right, yeah? So, water not supposed to flow like that. You never see a river like that. So, your physical structure don't really have them type of things where, whereby you have water actually flowing in them kind of crooked and, and thing like in your home and them type of thing there. Like your physical structure, you have your arteries and you have your veins and you have your capillaries and that water is in constant motion, constant motion, constant motion, constant motion, constant motion. And as even through your skin, water evaporates as sweat, right? And even within the atmosphere, the same water actually tenderizes and moistens your skin. Right, and you drink the water, you eat, get the water in the fruits, whatever it is. So, at the end of the day, we must have that full understanding that 
when we push out positive energy within the world, we are actually doing our own self a service, right? Because understanding that when we speak positivity, when you utter a word, right? When you say something, that creates a particular vibration, okay? So a frequency. So as I'm speaking right now, I'm speaking, right? The reason why you hear in my voice is just because I'm wind or air is actually going over my vocal cords. I mean, you already can't hear me because I have vocal cords there that air actually pass over and it vibrates and then it creates a sound. So the same way that as the air, as that energy, that vibration, uh, right? Because I'm sure if I'm here and I'm, uh, uh, you know, you could feel the vibration is going through. Mm, I can feel it in my, on my teeth. I, and you can feel it, it's vibrating, it's energy. So that same way, as you utter that, it actually goes through the atmosphere. And also the atmosphere, as you were saying, contains plenty of water, water vapor. Right, so then that same cut goes up into the heavens and falls down as rain. As they say, praises, praises go up and blessings come down. Holy Manuel I, Celestia I, Jah, Rastafari. Definitely we do give thanks for life and a mighty life when we divide, do give thanks for this divine opportunity to be with you once more in St. Lucia and the rest of the world as definitely, you know, we are encouraging people, man. Take a time out every day, you know, before 6 o'clock in the morning, from 5.30 in the morning before the sunrise. You know, wake up in the morning before 5.30, before the sunrise, you know, and send out some words of love deliberately. You know, say, you know, you know I send out love to the world, to the sick, sick and the suffering, to those in pain, to those who have been abused and traumatized. To those who have been victims of whatever, whatever, whatever that you're talking about. I mean, any form of cruelty. I mean, we send calm and peace and tranquility into their lives. Send blessings, powers, right? Prosperity, energy into their lives. I mean, if, if, if consciously 10,000 of us do that every morning, right? After a while, 100,000 of us do that every morning. Then a million of us right every morning, then 10 million, then 100 million, then a billion people. Imagine that everyone in the world get up in the world wherever they are in their time zone at 5.30 in the morning and send positive energy into the world. This world would have been Zion, heaven. Right? So, as I say, on earth as in heaven, if you want to practice them things and if you want these things there to actually manifest, right? Them things there is things that we have to actually continually practice as a people. We have to actually, you know, put it into action, ritualistically. Right, sending out positivity into the world. Ja, Rastafari, dog food. Oh my, peace, love, and light king. Give thanks, honorable. Mommy Stronger, 80, and give thanks, my lord. Love, love, love. Okay, we would build another pyramid. Laugh out loud. Okay, man, we'd have built pyramids. We would have, we would become living pyramids because we are pyramids, you know, man. You can see we are pyramid. If you just, see, I am a step pyramid. You see, step pyramid. It's different. I just have a, a bowl of flame up upon, upon my head, lighting and, show, and showing the way. But we are all pyramids. We would become the living pyramids. Why? Because we actually send forth that energy into the world. It's the 7 o'clock hour and definitely we are due for an intercession. And what we're going to do specifically, we're going to have an open discussion today. So we are going to invite you to give us a call, ask your questions on, on YouTube, ask your questions on Facebook. And definitely we're going to have an interaction. So think of the questions you want to ask and definitely type them on YouTube or you could call in our, our open line that's going to be open shortly and definitely we could have an interaction. Ja Rastafari. Blessed.
St. Lucia Police Force Prison, Kaiso Headquarters 14, we still standing, Friday, July 5th at the National Cultural Center from 8.30 p.m. Featuring Joint Operation, Spoiler, Sack, Frano, Siwo, Mushi, Cassie from Port Police, Bella, Lady Poxy, AP, Mighty Square from Bodley, and Defending Monarch Snow. Admission $25. Music by the Royal St. Lucia Police Band, Intrapreneur Response. Ticket outlet, Steve's Barbershop, Police and Allied Credit Union, Castries Fire Service, Beaufort Police Station, and the Supra Police Station. The Royal St. Lucia Police Force, Kaiso Headquarters 14, the safest fit. This summer, get ready, set for school with the Educator or Educator Plus loan from the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. No more back-to-school stress. The Educator loans will take care of everything you need, including school fees, materials, and supplies. Up to $10,000 for primary and secondary students and up to $20,000 for young adults with affordable payments for up to four years. Call or visit us for more information today. The Educator and Educator Plus loan only at the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. Save and borrow with pride. Terms it's not easy getting rid of these types of greases every day. It's hard work. But if you really think about it, it's not really us doing the cleaning. At Atwell Daglish, we believe it's all about the product. Our extensive new line of ChemClean products are extremely concentrated, eco-friendly, effective and guaranteed to make your life a whole lot easier. Whether you're cleaning at home, the office or at industrial type spaces, when it comes to food-based solvents, sanitizers, cleaners, floor care, commercial machines and dispensers for laundry care, let the product do most of the work for you. Introducing the best brands in the cleaning business from ChemClean Limited, only available at Atwell Daglish. Yes, we give thanks. I'm definitely as we live again on national television and also on YouTube, streaming live from my channel and also on Calabash Television channel on Facebook. Okay, so any questions? I mean, we could open up the phone lines. Any question that we have, we could actually take that question and go on to the 7.30 hour. So Caleb here was asking about how to join the Rastafari religion. You see, that is, when it comes to, 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 to um, I would say, theological aspects of things, I would, I would more just pass this to Right Honorable Priest Isaac. You know, so you could check Priest Isaac's channel, that is Priest Isaac. You could check his channel, I mean, he'll definitely be able to educate you extensively. But you don't join the Rastafari. Leave it, it's a leave it, it's a way of life. What you do, you actually become Rastafari. You know, you become Rastafari. That means that the way you live, the way you speak, the way you dress, the way you talk, the rituals you keep, you know, um, everything. I mean, so it's a leave it, it's a way of life. So you don't join it, you actually begin to live like a Rastafari. What herbal blend should you use for acne? If you want to control acne, you have to actually balance your hormones. You know, so definitely you have to de-stress. Don't stress too much as a first step. Try to just live in a love and peace and calm way. Don't stress too much. And you could look at herbs like your St. John's bush. St. John's bush is a very good herb. Red raspberry. That's, that will also help to balance out your hormones. Vervine. Vervine is extremely good for that. And you are also looking at herbs like your marigold. Okay, the marigold plant is a very, very good herb for just for any human issues. And for external use, you could use the cassia lata or the ceracy bush. Any of these things there would actually um, assist you. How do I stop cracking off bones? You drink plenty of sea moss. You could drink plenty of sea moss. Sea moss, sea moss, sea moss, sea moss, sea moss, sea moss, sea moss. Every single day, sea moss. Sea moss porridge, sea moss smoothie, sea moss, sea moss, sea moss. Sea moss is a moss. All right, and then drink a lot more water to lubricate the joints. Which, with so much pedophilia in the world, how can one be tolerant of su to such horrible actions? What horrible actions are you talking about? I don't know. What, what, what actions? I don't know. Um, Hash God, I don't know what actions you're talking about. Did I miss something? I, I think I missed some things there. Yes, when, when, um, blah, blah, blah. When, yes, I have great sauce. What are some good foods for a pregnant woman? 
pregnant woman, hmm. CMOS again, right? CMOS for a pregnant woman is very, 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 very good. It helps the woman actually, it helps the child, the development of the bone structure of the child is be extremely good. Okay, also you look at Zepina, Amaranthus dubius. Amaranthus dubius is very rich in iron, extremely rich in iron. So, like you're supposed to have a green soup of Amaranthus dubius every single day. Spinach, right? Um, the, the, the wild one, the wild spinach. Okay, so that every day, every day, every day, every day, every day, the green soup. And then you have the amaranth grain, which is also extremely rich in iron. That you could utilize a lot. A lot of okra. Okra helps in the delivery. It's rich in iron and also helps in the delivery. Right, the delivery aspect of stuff. When you're delivering, the same way the okra is mucilaginous, it's very slippery. The same way it helps the passage of the baby to be extremely like nice and easy. Red raspberry green drinks, very good intermittently. Because the red raspberry itself can, because does make the, the the womb very tight too. So, so I mean, intermittently you use the red raspberry to help to keep the iron levels extremely high. All right. So all your nice grains like your amaranth grain, your teff, your quinoa, all these things they are good. Okay. How do I keep my energy high when I am in places of low vibration? Well, I mean, definitely you remain grounded in self. You know, you check the reality of things. You know, and. Why would you be in a place of low vibration? You're always supposed to put yourself in a place of high vibration. You know, so you have to be more conscious of the spaces you choose to actually keep yourself in. That's why even the, the, the prayer says, lead me not into temptation. So you shouldn't lead yourself into temptation, meaning that you shouldn't really go into a space of low vibration and then fight, try to find a way to actually rise up your vibration. You know, that, that space that you are in is supposed to create high vibration spaces all the time around your own self. But if, for instance, you are in a low vibration space, keep an inner calm within yourself because it's self. Everything is within you. It's not like you have to go out of you to live, you know, because you could imprison the body, but you can't imprison the mind. You know, so your thoughts, your thoughts, your thoughts, your thoughts, your thoughts. So your thoughts are going to dictate exactly how your physical structure responds to your space. Due to college and household. Okay, all right, one, one second. Honorable, any herbs recommended for Graves' disease? I mean, see, most of these conditions specifically, you need to actually reboot your entire immune system. You know, and also what you need to, you, it's not just a, a herb, it's a lifestyle change because healing is a culture. So there are plenty of things that you actually need to do. You know, it's not just drink one herb. No, I mean, there will be, yes, there are plenty of herbs like the cannabis oil and the cannabis syrup and the cannabis itself as a green juice and the vervine, right, and the stinging nettle. And, you know, you have your, your guinea hen weed, all these herbs that would actually help and assist. But also, you must understand that you need a lifestyle change, a lifestyle change. What do you use to get rid of fibroids, large ones? Well, we have a 21-day program. As I say, you don't just use one thing to take out thing. You have to go through a process. Yes, Bosses, you call her. Blessed? Yes, Blessed. What yes. can I drink for a acid stomach? Yeah, it's, it's very, the, the volume is very low. I could hardly hear. What can you drink for what? Acid stomach. Acid stomach. Okay, I mean, you could use patchouli. Patchouli is very good for acid stomach. Patchouli tea. Okay. Patchouli Yeah, patchouli tea. Yeah, very good. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Bless it. Yes. Yeah. Four five one nine three four nine four five three one seven three zero. Definitely give us a call. Both as you call or give thanks for life. How will I lose weight? With, how will I lose weight? Will drink a lot. How will I? Don't overstand now and there. What do you use to get rid of well, well, fibroids, we have what you call a female package. The, is the, the female package is the package of six medicines. The colon cleanser, which is the free up laxative that actually cleans out and lubricates the colon and nourishes it also. Then you have the, the blood detox, which basically cleanses out the blood and cleans your cellular. And on, on a cellular level, I mean, and, and helps to clean and detoxify the liver. We have the home cleanser, which actually helps to clean out the home and balance the hormones. You have the pure green to alkalize and build up the blood. The pure gold to remove mucus from your physical structure. And your fade over, which is a guinea hen weed syrup, which actually regulate your blood. All right, so these six plus the answer 
which helps to swing the fibroids directly is basically a seven product package that we have to actually help to treat the fibroids so this is actually um seven products you repeat three times within a 21 day period okay that and then we give you a specific nutritional guideline that's what you do to help with the fibroids all right i love your ben i love your show and wealth of knowledge that you have why didn't you finish the med program i recently graduated from medical school and i will go into holistic practice our food is our medicine well i mean i don't know why you asked me why i didn't complete the med program i i think i reached as far as i wanted to you know i i spent three years in medical school in cuba then i did two semesters at spartan medical school and still did another three to four years at the america university of antica college of medicine where i graduated from my basic sciences right and then did all my rotations it's when it comes to placement in the hospital you know i i didn't really want no placement in the hospitals you know basically i had to take up to 17 vaccines just to go into a hospital you know i rather stop there than to take a why, why would i take 17 vaccines just to to get into into um 17 vaccines just to get into a hospital i could just create my own medical school and my own medical thing I'm, you know you know the whole medical school thing is a theory you know is one person's theory i think that i myself is in a good space enough to create a whole different you know scenario when it comes to the whole aspect of healthcare so ben yes man i give thanks and definitely i don't regret any aspect of my medical school experience and i think that i i, I have learned as much as and even more than many of my peers that i went to medical school with and i fully embrace all the knowledge i have learned and that is what i have utilized um, even in the, having a greater understanding of how to actually create a space within the physical structure and even a, a space because going to medical school i mean i saw with my own eyes what happens that's why i really couldn't endorse it you know so i had to come and create my own my own meditation when it comes to what i feel that the ancestors want me to actually do so that's why we create mon kailash rejuvenation center you know which is a space created to whereby people could come and 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 get holistically taken care of not just take care of symptoms and cut hair and cut there and do that yeah i know i do agree that as ancient scientists there are times when we have to dive into the physical structure uh, you know because we are gods and 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 go in and fix up stuff you know there are times that we have to do that and i do fully appreciate appreciate love and fully embrace my experience at medical school all of, all of what i went to through from cuba to Spartan, you know, to America University of Antigua, all of them I went to, I, I fully em embrace it, all the knowledge I have gained. And plus, I do also embrace, you know, um, my studies as in herbal medicine, okay? And acupuncture, you know, and copying and moxibotion, all them things, I fully do it. Hash God, you spoke of intolerance, but how can a person be tolerant of human trafficking? How can we just send positivity to stop this trafficking of children in the sex trade? I mean, if you stay there and you just complain about it and you don't at this, I mean, if you send some positive energy, right? That means, you see, if you think about something, the more you think about it and the more you speak about it, the more it, it, it becomes in your heavens, the more it occupies your mind. The more something occupies your mind, the more it becomes a reality because the mind is the so the, the ground where you sow and your thoughts are the seeds that you actually sow in it. So whatever you want to do, you have to think of it first. So if people begin to think positively of taking care of human trafficking, then you would have even the police officer and the immigration officers and all the custom officers and all these people there, if they got up in the morning and and they, they, they speak of that energy, then their mind would be very observant. They would be looking out for them things there. They would be, yeah, man, they would be, yeah, man, they'd be able to do the job extra good. I mean, you'd be surprised just because they're saying that, yeah, man, they, 
they could hear yeah, a man, I mean, because that's what's in the heavens, it's in the awareness, so they become aware, so they could actually see exactly what is happening. So, not, not abracadabra, you know, when you speak things and you say things all the time, blessed love, blessed love, blessed love, I mean, it keeps you in a state of being whereby you could talk to the God in somebody else, you talk to the God in yourself, you calm your own self. Yes, good land scholar, blessed. Yes, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm talking about acupuncture. The vo um, can you speak up, please? For what is good, and for what acupuncture is good? What's that? Acupuncture, for what is good? Well, acupuncture is good for a lot of different things. I mean, for fertility problems, back pain, insomnia, heart disease, anything that you could think about. Acupuncture is like a way, a treatment that is used for all types of conditions. Is it for tumor? Well, I mean, you, you would not just use acupuncture alone to deal with a tumor. Okay, you could use acupuncture with other, with other modalities. So you could use acupuncture with poultices, with herbal teas, with green juices, you know. So even what we would do is acupuncture. Isn't what you have a tumor? Yes, we could use acupuncture, but not acupuncture alone to treat the tumor. We would use acupuncture with a combination of plenty other aspects to actually help you with tumor. Okay? So who, who, who gives him the acupuncture? What's that? Who, who is that that gives him the acupuncture? Well, we have therapists at, we have therapists at, at MKRFC and the great physician international that actually take care of these things. Okay? Okay. Okay. Alright, brother. Give thanks. All right. Um, yes, man. Love, love. Do, honorable, do I have to have a diagnosis to take your cleanser? No, man. You could actually just go on our website, prescalash.com, and buy, buy either one of the cleanser, the blood cleanser or the free up laxative, which is actually a colon cleanser. And cleanliness begins in the colon, man. When you flush it out and take out all that kind of a waste, you'd be, feel like a brand new person. Ben, that's what makes you credible because you understand medicine and natural healing. I took the flu vaccine and my blood sugar was crazy high. It was the first time taking such a vaccine. I did intermittently fasting for five weeks and my blood sugar self-regulated. Plus avoid all simple refined sugars. Yeah, but you know that. So, Ben, at the end of the day, right, it's not that what makes me, my understanding, um, when they call like the voice is like a bit like shaky. So we really cannot make it out properly when they call so when you call caller just 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 understand that we try our best to actually hear you better ben i mean you say well that's what makes me that, that that doesn't make me credible because what medical what medical school did for me is that it provided me with a scientific foundation or it it, it because i i always wanted to be in science and i did science from college you know and secondary school was science college science university science you know then that what what it did was that it actually accredited what my parents had actually taught me what my grandparents had taught me because at medical school i was able to see that the great majority of the pharmaceuticals you know they came from the active component of it actually came from plants you know so that actually gave me the capacity to say oh wow what my grandmother was saying has always been true you know one and these people make our elders and our ancestors seem like as if they don't know what they're about. So it helped me to accredit what my ancestors have been doing over the years. It does not make me credible because there are plenty of people who know plenty of stuff who never went to medical school. You know, it's not that it assisted me. I'm telling you, man, science is our foundation. No one should actually run from science. I'd love for all my children and everyone in the world to learn about how the physical structure functions. I'm telling you, yes, yes. But uh, is, that doesn't mean that someone who don't go through that process does not, is not credible in what they're doing because there is that just all knowing and there's that knowledge handed down through our ancestors like years, thousands of years where information has been passed on that is very important for us to actually follow. All right. You see, Ben, you were able to heal yourself. I hope when you go to the hospital, you, 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 you fast. You tell your clients to fast and you, and you know that they could self-regulate and you don't get caught up and just prescribe pills for them, you know. Right? Um, okay? Hash God, what are your thoughts on alkaline water? 
there is nothing like alkaline water. You know, water is H2O, okay? If water is supposed to have an alkalinity of 7 point something or 7, all right, when you get, when, when water becomes 9 or when the, 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 the pH of, of that fluid is 9, then, I mean, come on, it's not just water. It is some other kind of, it's, it's, I mean, it's, it's a fluid, but, you, know, you understand, yeah. Okay, Ben. Ben says that he did his basic sciences in St. Lucia to at the International American University School of Medicine. Oh, good, good for you, my brother. Good for you, man. I mean, you see, you know the vibes. And so I hope that you pass that message on to the people. And say, I then completed my clinicals in the U.S. Oh, Ben, congratulations, man. All the best, man. I hope that you use all that love that you have to assist the people of the world. Um, can I take the Guinean weed capsule? You see, you see the thing about them capsules is that sometimes the capsule, the shell of the capsule itself is pig fat, right? So, so, so if some, sometimes they might tell you, okay, yes, uh, but da, 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 it's, it's um, gelatin or it's, it's pig fat, you know, or, or if they say, well, it's vegetable, then I mean, you could think that, but I, I rather use the herbs. Okay, use the herbs. I try to get the herbs. Um, human and human. Honorable, what are some herbs to begin at, on at home? You want some herbs to begin at home? On at an at home apothe apothecary. I cannot pronounce them English words, you know. Forgive me, you know, I'm not English. I'm just an African man right here trying to speak this dyslexic no knowledge. Pardon me. Well, I mean, some basic herbs I always tell people to get is some vervine, sting nettle, guinea henweed, basil, patchouli, ginger. All these herbs are very simple herbs that you could utilize. You know, um, um, turmeric, your little um, um, parsley, I said parsley already, yeah, all them herbs there, um, spring onions, what they call chives, all them, there are some good herbs you could start up with. Your little cayenne pepper, start with these things there. Can I order the herbs from your website? You have to order the herbs from our WhatsApp, the herbs that you need, right? So 1758 722 3660. That's 1758 722 3660. What is the best food for recovery after workout? A very good, strong, you could, you could have like, okay, you could put like one banana, right? And you could put um, a handful of walnuts, a handful of dates, three tablespoons of sea moss, well heaped tablespoons of sea moss, and three glasses of water in a blender. Blend until smooth, and you could also put like an inch of 100% cocoa. I mean, the real cocoa, and I'm not talking about chocolate, like 100% chocolate, I'm talking about cocoa, right? If you want to boost up more energy and have more heat, and blend that until smooth and drink that, and then you're good, good to go, good to go. All right, Ben says again, indeed, the drugs are very toxic because of all the chemicals. I'm anti-drugs and pro-eating from nature. The Bible tells us so, and truly, that's the only answer for healing. Thanks for the blessings. Oh, my brother, it's just love, you know, man. I just love, you know, so just love, 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 love. That's all it's about. The foundation of healing is love. Just to have that love for people, I mean, definitely, that will guide your action. Okay, Ben. Ben says, well, I would love to learn from you. Of course, man, you're learning from me already, and, I, and I'd love to learn from you too because you could teach me plenty of things too. Is iron sharp enough? Iron, the continent of one man, bright enough another. Because okay, so I'd love to learn from the eye, also, honorable. So we give thanks definitely, as it is important that we have that great overstanding of ourselves and what we are doing. You know, 4519349. I mean, come on, call us, man. You all stop calling. What happened, man? Come on, call us. 4519349453 Definitely. Give us a call and we could move and see what can happen, how we will uplift ourselves. We are due for another intercession, definitely. We'll take an intercession as we are also live on Calabash Television here in St. Lucia. You could look at Calabash TV um, Facebook page, definitely, and also Calabash TV YouTube channel. Look at it. Most of our videos are also on there. So you could have a look at that. Right? And we are live on our channel, which is Priscilla channel definitely you could subscribe to that right and keep it coming and you would actually definitely see 
when we are on and we're giving some up uplifting lectures to the people. 4519-349-453-1730, give us a call. Definitely, we do for an intercession. When we come again, we are going to continue taking your calls and your questions. Ja, Rastafari, bless it. Have a bank of solution for every solution, building our future today. We are the bank of solution for every solution, with you every step of the way. Always there for you, serving you and me. The solution way, we like family. Always there for you, helping you and me. BOSL News for me. The Bank of St. Lucia For every solution Bank of St. Lucia All the bank you need The Royal St. Lucia Police Force presents Kaiso Headquarters 14 We're still standing Friday, July 5th At the National Cultural Center From 8.30pm Featuring Joint Operation Spoiler Zach Frano Siwo Mushi Kasi from Port Police Bella Lady Poxy AP Mighty Square from Bodley and Defended Monarch Snow. Admission $25. Music by the Royal St. Lucia Police Band, Intrepid Response. Ticket outlet, Steve's Barbershop, Police and Allied Credit Union, Castries Fire Service, Beaufort Police Station, and the Supra Police Station. The Royal St. Lucia Police Force, Kaiso Headquarters 14, the safest fit. This summer, get ready, set for school with the Educator or Educator Plus loan from the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. No more back-to-school stress. The Educator loans will take care of everything you need, including school fees, materials, and supplies. Up to $10,000 for primary and secondary students and up to $20,000 for young adults with affordable payments for up to four years. Call or visit us for more information today. The Educator and Educator Plus loan only at the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. Save and borrow with pride. Terms and conditions apply. What makes a great sign? Simplicity, creativity, huge and loud, small and quiet. At Excel Sign, we help clients all over St. Lucia create the perfect sign for their business needs. Our printing takes place right here with state-of-the-art machines to get the job done at the highest quality. We specialize in a wide variety of pilot signs, vehicle wraps, channel letters, billboards, 3D letters, and lots more. Designed to have high visibility, longer life, and great value. Call or visit Excel Sign today and find out how we can help your business express itself. Excel Sign, taking signs further. Yes, Give Thanks, definitely we live again on Calabash Television, Give Thanks for Life, and we also live on YouTube, live streaming. So all those people who have been with us, we give thanks for your divine presence, and we pray that, you know, you keep on being with us, as you know, we love the eye, and the eye, and the eye, and the eye. Yep. Thank you very much. Yes, Kayla Pierre, Honorable, what can I use to take away max on my skin and to make it look healthy? You could use sour soap leaf to scrub the skin. You could use cassia lata leaf to scrub the skin. You could use glory cedar or quick, quick stick to, to scrub the skin. Any of them things that's very good to scrub the skin, to take off max of the skin. Then you could use 100% coconut oil or you could use 100% shea butter. Any of them things that would be good for you. All right. Tawanda Bannett. Thank you very much. Oh, give thanks. You're welcome, Honorable. Give thanks. Heart of love. 451-9349-453-1730. Yes, Grace. Blessed. Hi, Grace. How are you? I'm blessed. Give thanks. How are you doing? Yes. Give thanks. Blessed love. Blessed love. Yes. I have a problem. Because I'm, a, I'm diabetic and all day long I have no problem. Once you see, I sat down for a little while. I just feel my foot burning me so much. I have a big burning sensation in my foot. How can you help me, please? Well, I mean, first and foremost, you have to stop calling yourself a diabetic. Don't say, well, I am a diabetic. You are a human being. Okay? You are, you are a woman that suffers from diabetes, but you're not a diabetic. You know, so that's labeling yourself. 
All right, so you have to separate yourself. Okay, from the sorry about it. I'm suffering from diabetes. <laughs> All right, mm. now, what you have in, is what you call diabetic neuropathy. Okay, so your nerves are getting are starting to get damaged. So you don't just take something for it. You have to you have to begin by. I don't write. write anything. Huh? huh? About volume. All right. Mete phone at the left in the right hand. Cut the TV. Okay, please. Thank you very much. Yeah, love, bless. Yeah, love. So what I'm saying is that don't call yourself a diabetic. Just say that you are uh you are suffering from diabetes. You don't call yourself a diabetic. Okay, all right. So then, what you need to do? Because of the increased blood sugar levels, that's damaging your nerves. So you're having what they call diabetic neuropathy, which is like a, a pathology of the nerves. So you feel that, that burning sensation. Now, since nerves and blood vessels hand, run side by side, right, then you'd be also affecting your circulatory system. So you have to regulate the blood sugar levels, number one, naturally, to help to prevent further damage of your nerves and your vessels. You know, by that, you know, you could actually use your guinea hen wheat, which is rich in sulfur. You could use um, your neem. You could use um, your cocoa tea. You could use, right, your ceracy bush. You could use even the, the fruit of the ceracy that you could actually utilize also. And exercising, exercise, exercise, exercise. Avoid all, all starchy foods, right? And also what you do, you constantly... You know, you, you keep a clear and a free mind, free from stress and disease and them kind of bad thoughts and them things there. That help to balance your blood sugar level properly. When you balance your blood sugar level, definitely you're going to help your nerves. Now, to help the nerves, you could use some marijuana tea, you could use some vervine tea, right? You could use some fit with tea, what they call shadow many. All these things, they are very good for the nerves, right? Okay. Thank you da, 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 very much. Kayla, honorable guys. The max of the skin. How do you feel about honey? I've been plant-based for a few months now and I have been staying away from it because of a lack of knowledge. Well, I mean, I'm not vegan, you know, right? So, honey is not something that I use extensively, but honey has its attributes. Honey is powerful if you get burnt, you understand? So, there are ways that you could use honey in medicine. Not something I use if you just drink honey, drink honey, no. But honey is a very powerful medicine. Central Cash is blessed. Hello, good night, sir. Yes, blessed. Health last. Yes, I have I have a shoulder pain. A shoulder from pain, uh huh? April. From yes. April. It's from my neck right down to my elbow. Uh huh. So I don't know if you could prescribe something for me to rub or something. What do you have to do? You have to like get some get some um castor oil. You warm up the castor oil. You add some cayenne pepper powder to it until it's like grainy in your hands. Okay, and you massage the area. Alright? You massage the area. Deep tissue massage. And afterwards you take they have a plant they call the watchet. The watchet. It's a cactus. It's a flat cactus. You warm it up over, over the stove or over the steam of, of water boiling until it's nice and soft and hot and you cut it halfway. You put it at the back of your hand to ensure that your, your skin can tolerate the heat and you use it to rub upon the area. Okay? And if you could even put it around the shoulder with some sea salt and, and, and bandage it in around the area, it's also extremely important. Drink a lot more sea moss helps the joints. Have you ever heard of comfrey or used it? Well, comfrey, I've used comfrey. Some people say, well, comfrey is a bad herb, but I had an experience in Dominica at a time, and I had um, an experience where someone was suffering extensively with diarrhea, and nothing was working. And what worked for me was the roots of the comfrey and the young leaves of the, of the guava. Very good to stop diarrhea and vomiting. Oh, yeah. Um, blah, blah, blah. How often can I drink Ceraci tea and what is it really good for? I mean, Ceraci is a dewormer, helps to regulate the blood sugar levels, cleanses out the liver, helps to cleanse out the womb. Very, very, very good. Very potent plant. Okay, thanks. Adam Alfred, blessed love, honorable. Adam, man, you late today, man? You just come in, man? Oh, my goodness. Adam is normally one of the first persons to bless me up. Adam is a bit late today. 
Give thanks, Adam, for being early all the other nights. Yeah, so 451-9349-453-1730. Definitely give us a call on YouTube, Facebook. If you have a question, definitely ask your question that we could actually assist you and answer you. We have another 15 minutes remaining. So let's make use of it. Let's make use of the 15 minutes that we have remaining. You see, I have some questions on WhatsApp too, but if I go on the WhatsApp, then what happens is that I stop the live stream. Okay, so I'll have to get another phone that I could answer your WhatsApp questions and then, you know, still be able to keep the stream going. 451-9349-453-1730. I know, honorable, I didn't get the notification. Oh, give thanks, Adam, man. Pardon me there, man. Next time, I, will I talk to YouTube about that, man? They didn't give you that notification, man. What happened to them? How what do them? Okay, all right. Give thanks, definitely. Any more questions as we are closing up and we are going to close shortly? You know, um, don't have me be speaking alone. I mean, there are many things that you could say and do. We give thanks as definitely tomorrow is Monday and we will be in office in Castries. As you know, we'll be out of state from Thursday this strong. For about a seven days or so. So definitely those of you who would want to see us. Make an effort to see us on Monday and on Wednesday. You know we operate by appointments only. So that you just call in the landline 451758-451-8813. Or you could call or WhatsApp 1758-722-3660 to book your consultations. As you know it's by appointments only. Right? So... Anyone who wants to see us, definitely you know what tomorrow will be there. Yes, Mon Dudo Caller, blessed. Hi, blessed love. Honorable, how are you doing? Not so bad, thanks. Oh, okay, give time. So, I'm calling for a friend. Mm -hmm. His hands, like the brown lines, they have lots of holes and sometimes it hurts him. Like, do you have anything he could use to rub or something? Well, it would be good that I, I could see a picture of what he's talking about. When you say that holes, what are you talking about? Like 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 wounds? Like sores? It, no, it has like holes. It makes holes and it has like a little white thing that comes out of it. And it, like it's really painful. He, he have to clean out his blood. Yeah. So Pardon? He have to clean out his blood. Oh, okay. Yeah, and soak the hands in some cime contour. You know what cime contour is? Get some feuille du vent and some cime contour, right? And also some ginger, right? You mm -hmm. boil them three things together and you add like a three tablespoons of sea salt and you make him soak the hand inside of it and squeeze like the juice of probably a sour orange and leave the rind in it and make him soak the hands in it because the hands is like an extremity. The hand does, does, does just be... Like dung, dangling. So any toxins or anything can actually settle in the hands and the foot. So with that, it's good to actually do a nice warm herbal bath of the hands. And then, you know, he needs to cleanse out his physical structure. Ask him to come and get a mail package. Okay. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. Bless it. Just teach in these last few moments, Honorable. Hmm. But you can teach me too. So can I use CMOS every day, Aya? Yes, Aya. Yes, Aya. You can use that every single day. You cannot use it too much at all. Right? You see, they say teaching is better than preaching. Yeah, I, I, I would love to teach, but, you know, you direct me. Tell me what you want me to, what you want me to teach you. Huh? Grimes, what is it that you want me to teach you? Please, tell me. Okay. What herb you use for hydrocephalic in the fallopian tube? Well, I would more use like a, a, a herbs you could use is vervine, um, cerasi bush, calabash, the, in, the inner pulp of the calabash like a syrup, St. John's bush, right? Um, Red raspberry, all them herbs are very good to clean the home. Okay, catnip. Okay, all those herbs are very good to clean the home. And also, 
I would have used poultices, uh, uh, activated charcoal poultice probably with some ginger, some turmeric, some vervine, any one of these herbs with some sea salt and cayenne pepper. A poultice on the outside. Honorable, any recommendations on enlarged uterus? My sister was diagnosed. Get a female package, right? Get a female package and do a nice castor oil pack, you know, over it. And, but first apply castor oil with cayenne pepper and a tingle of sea salt over the home and put a warm castor oil pack over it. That's, that's very good. Can you tell good quality sea moss? Yes. Clean. And when you soak it, it forms gels. Very good. I see your energy alone is enough. Okay, all right, beloved. I had no answer. Answer for what? Grimes, I don't know what you're talking about. Please be clear. Ronald Williams, what can I tell people a good substitute for egg for breakfast food? I and I know applesauce for baking. What can I, why, is, why you want to tell people about it for? What about just do it for yourself? I mean, by right, we're not supposed to eat eggs, so you don't need really need a substitute, but if you really want, you could use chickpeas. Chickpeas does do a nice little stew, it almost eggy. Right, and breakfast, apple sauce, I don't use them kind of things there. Okay, thank you, Nicole Carson. Okay, thank you, you're welcome, honorable. Chickpeas, very good, better than egg. Right, um, chickpeas, you could use the chickpeas, you could make some nice chickpea cakes. You know, you could butter it down and make a nice little um, hummus with the chickpea. That's very good. You ask, what, what could I teach you? I couldn't think of anything. Of course you can. <laughs> Love. You, see that you have it there. Right Love. Eat some still cut oatmeal. Okay, all right, Adam. Give thanks for your contribution. Yes, Cassius Caller. Blessed. Blessed love, good Honorable night, how are you? I'm blessed, give thanks for How asking. is the family? The family is blessed. Okay, God bless you all. Thanks for the blessing. What about yes, you? Yes, how are you? you continue to do a good work. Give thanks. Yes, I wanted to ask you, um, after I will listen to you on the air, the f can you use the frozen simos? And how do you use it? Do you boil it? The frozen one? I, I will uh, um, listen to you. So have a good night. Okay, love, give thanks. We don't really freeze the sea moss. As long as you soak the sea moss in some hot water, right? I personally would leave my sea moss on the outside. Soak it in some, in some hot water and keep it in a nice glass bowl and keep it covered outside. And use it every day, every day, every day from outside, okay? Um, it will last me for about three days. It will stay three days. It won't spoil. Or you could put it in the refrigerator to keep it cool. You don't freeze sea moss. Don't freeze it at all. You have to freeze it. Keep it alive. All right. Oh, the gel. Don't, 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 you don't, you don't, don't freeze the gel. Don't freeze it. Leave it in the ref, in the refrigerator. Keep it cool, and just use it straight. Just blend it, boil it, or whatever, and do a do a porridge, a tea, or you know, do a smoothie. Don't, don't freeze it. It's not good to freeze it at all. You kill it. I saw one video of you cooking a stew. Will, will you do more cooking videos? Well, I mean, blessings to the great mother. Okay. Of course, I will do more. How often should a woman do a castor oil pack? As often as she needs. She could just treat herself good. There's nothing to lose, everything to gain. Blessed love, is the home cleanser a green juice tincture or syrup? The home cleanser is like a mixture of calabash. The calabash gel is used to act. The calabash itself naturally ferment so it is used to extract all the phytochemicals from all the other herbs so it's like a natural decoction infusion tincture kind of mix not really something you add anything just the herbs and infused in the calabash to extract all the active components and then bottled um thank you for the thank you the calabash is new i'll add it I am already using the other herbs, St. John's Bush Extract. Give thanks. The calabash syrup is very potent for cleansing the home. What is the best cleanser for liver? I mean, you could use sour orange. You could use cassia lata. All these things are very good liver cleansers. Vervine, right? All these things are very good liver cleansers. I will order the human package today. Okay, Dion Redwood. Give thanks. Adam Alfred. Milk fizzle is good for the liver. Okay, yeah, milk fizzle is good also. Right, Cascara Sagrada is good also. All them things, they are good. Okay? So definitely, 
451-9349-453-1730. Any other calls, let us know how you are doing today. Yes, Dolly World, give thanks. You are welcome. About eight more minutes. Give thanks as we are rounding off to close. Remember tomorrow. We'll be in office for consultation. So those of you who want to see us, definitely remember we're on Jerome Street at Liberty. We have an office right there. We have all our packages available. Male package, female package, hemp syrup, raslax syrup for insomnia, deworm to deworm, the answer for the immune system, circle early for circulation, prosperity to make the man more prosperous and give him a better direction, better erection. Definitely male package, six products, female package, six products. Also available on our website, priestkailash.com. That is priestkailash.com. Definitely. Any other questions as we are closing off? Yes, Grace. Bless her love. Yes, Miss Me again. Yeah. <laughs> I have the um, the white rubber and I'm making tea with it. Is it good? It's very good. It's very, 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 very good. Okay. I put hot water on it. Boiling water. Yes. And then I drink it as tea. That's good. But you could also like take Take about a five of the tops. Kin lachi and leila The tail. Yeah. Oh yes. Uh, I using the tail to it. I am taking the whole thing. It's like you take the the top of the plant, some of the leaves and the tail. Chop. Take, uh -huh. take five or seven of them, and you put about a cup of water in your blender and you add it. You blend it. You strain it. You drink it. It's very 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 good. Now. Okay. That same white vervain, you could take it if you have a peanut tree, right? A peanut tree. And you pong it, 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 pong it in a peanut tree. Alright? And then you take about a two ounces of it and you drink it direct. That, that cleans in you like you never get cleansed before. Okay, thanks very much. You're welcome. Mm. Love. Yes, I appreciate that. Love, love. Have love. a blessed night. You also, beloved. Uh, Give thanks. Yes. Blessed love. But thanks very much. Bye love, bye. Love, love. <laughs> should a woman remove her uterus? No! No woman should ever remove her womb. When a woman moves her womb, she takes off the woman. What you are remaining? The man. No moving the womb of the woman. Ways to get weight on plant-based lifestyle. Simos, 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 Simos. Helps you gain weight. Right? Amaranth also. Coconut oil. Good. Yes, Cedars. Blessed. Blessed love. Honorable. Give thanks. How are you doing? Yeah, how much is your package for um, the woman package? Hmm. Well, in St. Lucia, you have it at a different price. Because you see, right now, I'm talking to my people on the internet. Right? On the internet, it's 290 US. Okay? But in St. Lucia, you have it for 400 EC. Okay, thank you very much. Blessed love. Love, bless you. I am going to make some Seracity now. Okay, go ahead, man. That's very good. When you drink it, bless it up first. Love, love, love. And then try... And even if you use, try to use some nice spring water and have some nice water stored in some kind of a clay pot or something and put some stones in it and something to give it some life. You understand? Right? And then uh, when you when you, when you actually using it, make sure you use it properly. Okay? That you add some love into it. Add the, the herbs, boil the water and pour it over the herb. Don't boil the herb. Okay? And make sure you add love to it. Love, 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 love. Give thanks. We'll take one more question and then we'll actually close up. Rest well, honorable. Give thanks. Love, love, love. Mom is stronger. Etienne. Give thanks for the love. You know that? Okay, tell me. Rest well already. Seems like as if you see like I supposed to, to just rest. Okay, give thanks for the love. Give thanks. I will rest well. All right, I see a question on WhatsApp there. Let me, let me take that one there. Yes, I'm Masha. Blessed. Yes. Blessed. Yeah. What's your opinion of black seed oil? Well, black seed oil is a good oil. You know. I have utilized black seed oil. I have never been out. No credit. Okay, all right. Love. Bless. Yeah, I mean, um, black seed oil is a, is a good oil. Eh? I mean, I've used it um, in combination with some other medicines, especially when I deal with immune system diseases like HIV, AIDS, and them type of things. Um, it, it, it helps. It helps. It helps. It's all that helps. Helps. Um, okay. Yes, Ronald. Da, da, da. Do you like P73 oregano oil? I mean, I like oregano and I can make the oil. Ronald Williams. Yes, give thanks, honorable priests. 
Ole Manuel Ice, La Siaja, Rastafari. What of cod liver oil? I mean, cod liver, cod is a fish. And the oil of the liver of the fish, no. I'll, I'll say use coconut oil, use ganja oil, use um, chia, um, flaxseed oil, and them things there. Yes, before the caller, blessed. Yeah, I heard you mention um, Vevin Blanc. Mm. Vevin Blanc. Can you repeat what you do with it again, please? Well, I was talking about you could make a green juice from it, meaning that you use seven of the tops with the tail and a portion of the leaves, chop it and blend it and strain it and drink it, pong it or squeeze the juice and drink about a two ounce of it. That's very good. Angelina, give thanks, honorable, all love and prosperity, blessed love, give thanks, peace and love divine, give thanks, honorable, as we are closing off, someone was saying um, something about um, urinating a lot and the brain tumor, come and see us about that, you need the cannabis oil and you need the cannabis syrup and them things that will help you, yes, Kako Babuno, blessed love, Good night, Kudash. Yes, blessed and honorable. Yeah, um, what do you have for, to, to, drink, to drink for, for, for pain? We have, we have something called a raslak syrup. That's very good for pain. And we have a hemp syrup. That's very good for pain. These two things you could utilize, okay? You have it? Yeah, we have it, man. Leave it I And leave it Okay. Yeah. I thought I'm rubbing. I want to think. Yeah, it did work. It help you. Trust me. Okay, I'll pass you in the office tomorrow. Okay, love. Okay. Give thanks. Love, love, love. Bless it. Um, definitely give thanks as we are here about to close off right now as we have reached the hour of 8 o'clock, two minutes before. Orlin, Orlin, give thanks, Jagger, and keep blessing everyone with um, herbal knowledge. Yes, I mean, definitely... Definitely, the knowledge is an expensive knowledge. That's why you have to pay attention. You must pay attention to learn. Pay attention. Pay attention. Right? So, give thanks for the knowledge. Hail the eye. Blessed edification. Um, Doc Max, give thanks. All those people who were with us tonight, give thanks. Doc Max, Aureline, Angelina, Dione, Red Hood, give thanks. Ronald Williams, Adam Alfred, Mommy Stronger, Etienne, give thanks. Um, Grimes give thanks Dog food I mean give thanks my brother um, Grimes again Dolly World Give thanks Give thanks Give thanks Brad Amanda Give thanks Also Blessings the Great Mother Give thanks um, Nicole Carson Give thanks Who else Tawanda, give thanks. Kayla, Pierre, give thanks. All those of you from all around the world, we give thanks for all those people who participated, who full, full took in the whole activity tonight. Nicole, good night. Blessings to you and your family. Give thanks. All those of you who join us tonight, we do give thanks for your divine presence. And let's keep on sending the positive energy, you know, and that love to one another and keep it the bonds of love, you know. You know, tight and strong and firm. You know, all love and prosperity, peace divine. May Almighty God bless and keep you and make his holy face shine upon your holy face. Remember that our website is priestkalash.com. That is priestkalash.com. Priestkalash.com. And also, we have our store right in Raidery, Rodney Bay. And also, we have it on Jeremy Street, Liberty. 1758451. 8813 1758451 That's our landline and WhatsApp is plus 1758 That is 1758 Give thanks. All those of you who said give thanks again to I. If I have to go back and say give thanks to everyone again, I mean it's going to be a long night. So give thanks again. Heart of love. The Almighty God shine his holy face upon your holy face. Blessed love. Give thanks.
this summer. Get ready, set for school with the Educator or Educator Plus loan from the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. No more back to school stress. The Educator loans will take care of everything you need, including school fees, materials, and supplies. Up to $10,000 for primary and secondary students and up to $20,000 for young adults with affordable payments for up to four years. Call or visit us for more information today. The Educator and Educator Plus loan only at the St. Lucia Civil Service Cooperative Credit Union. Save and borrow with pride. Terms and conditions apply.